Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 1,262. Hey, if you want to download this workbook, Excel Magic Trick 1,260 to 1,262 and follow along, click on the link below the video. Hey, we've got a great video here. We have some time values when we want to see how to convert them to text as HHMM. And then over here, we want to see the reverse. We downloaded some text time values, and we need to convert them to actual time values. Now, time over here is a number. So anytime you're going from a number to text and you know the formatting you want to use, that's the perfect job for the text function. The value, hey, I'm going to click on that time value, which is a number, comma. And you have to know custom number formatting. Now, custom number formatting for time is pretty straightforward. H means hour and M means minute. So I simply, in double quotes, put my custom number formatting. Now, I need a lead 0. So instead of putting a single H, I put two H's. Now, instead of just 6, it'll put 0, 6. And then M, M. And that's it. H means hour, M means minute. And double quote, close parentheses, and there we have it. Control Enter, and boom, it's converted it from an actual time value to HHMM text. Double click and send it down, and boom. Now, the reverse is a little bit trickier, and that's a text value. Equals text, we're still going to use that. And you think, well, wait a second, that's supposed to be a number, but it'll work. Comma. And we cannot put double quotes and then HHMM because that HHMM depends on the fact that that's an actual proper time value, which is a decimal between 0 and 1 representing the proportion of one 24-hour day. So we're going to have to get tricky here. We'll just use the significant and insignificant digit holder 0. Now, I'm going to put two zeros because I'm definitely going to want to see the lead zero. But wait a second, that's text, and it doesn't have the colon. Well, in custom number formatting, you can insert characters. And we could put it in double quotes and join it. But there's an awesome custom number formatting character backslash. And that says to custom number formatting, whatever character you type next, in our case, colon, Please insert it. Zero, zero, end double quote, close parentheses. Now that is pretty amazing. Custom number formatting, it says two digits, and then insert a colon, and then the next two digits. Now this is a text function. When I control Enter, sure enough, that's exactly text. We need to convert now a text time number back to an official text number. So we F2 and any math operation converts text numbers back to numbers. I'm going to add 0, Control Enter. Now there's the proportion of one 24-hour day. That's 6 hours, 45 minutes divided by 24. To display as a time number, I'm simply going to come up here and choose time. Now I can double click and send it down. And boom, we've gone from text values, HHMM, to actual time values. Over here, time to actual text. So in either case, text with HHMM or text with 00, zero backslash colon 00, zero, zero, the text function does its job. All right, we'll see you next video.